Okay, important man, start by creating a simple scene. You can have multiple scenes in one file, but every scene is essentially a class that inherits from the class called C. You can have other types of scenes, but let's keep it simple. The construct method is called when a scene is rendered. There you will code your animations. Start by creating a simple circle with radius 2, color red and fill opacity of 0.1. But if we play it by running python-m manum, then the file name followed by the name of the scene, we won't see anything because each object when declared is not automatically animated. You have a couple of functions in the scene class that you will constantly use when animating. Self.play plays given animation on specific objects, self.wait waits some amount of time before rendering the next animation, self.add and self.remove adds and removes objects from the scene without playing any animations on them. We can write self.play draw border then fill C and we can add runtime as the duration of the animation. Let's add self.wait at the end and render it. We can see a simple circle that gets drawn and we wait afterwards before ending the video stream. Ok, let's add text, Manum Basics. Let's make Manum a bigger font, slant it and shift it a bit up and Basics shift it a bit down. Render both of the objects with the right animation. Also let's add an arc A with radius just a bit bigger than the circle and start angle, arc angle, color blue and bigger stroke just to look as a simple stopwatch. This time let's animate it using the create animation. And here we go, we have our thumbnail of the video. This has been Manum Basics in 100 seconds, like, subscribe and check out my channel for more.